So I am Dr. Sashank Doshi. I am an endocrinologist in a cardiology meeting. And you will be wondering what an endocrinologist is doing in a cardiology meeting. Now you know that diabetes and heart disease are very closely intertwined. In fact, in 2000, a uh, lot of associations like American Diabetic Association, American Heart Association, they came together and said, presence of diabetes, mere diagnosis of diabetes is equal to a heart attack. And therefore, diabetes is an acute myocardial infarction equivalent. Uh, but when people get diabetes, people don't think that they have acute myocardial infarction. That is the first thing. Now, naturally, when a diabetic has heart disease, he needs to be cared well. And selecting the appropriate anti-diabetic agent becomes a challenge. And therefore, it is important and imperative to understand that whenever you are selecting an anti-diabetic agent in diabetes, you must look at two considerations beyond cardiovascular safety. One is weight. And we need to have either weight neutral or weight loss agents. And second is hypoglycemia. We need to have agents which will cause less hypoglycemia or we need to give patient education which will cause less hypoglycemia. And then of course we have all this outcome data which has been emerging very rapidly, quickly, fast. So therefore when you look at diabetes and heart disease, you should follow a simple A, B, C, D, E approach. A for A1C and try to keep the A1C below 6.5 or 7. B for blood pressure, a tight blood pressure control. C for LDL cholesterol, try to keep it below 50 or 70 in a diabetic. D for diet and E for exercise. And if you are able to do all these A, B, C, D appropriately, you can have a normal quality of life in a diabetic with heart disease. Beyond this, what do we need to do? We need to do lifestyle, lifestyle and lifestyle. The most difficult thing in lifestyle is adhering to that lifestyle and losing weight. Many a time we are not able to lose weight. Therefore, you need to use meal replacements with bars and user-friendly you know, uh, nutritional packages which can make you lose weight. So therefore, my simple mantra to prevent heart disease and diabetes is eat less. Eat on time. Eat the right food. Cook in less oil or use blended oil. Then beyond that, if you have to go, exercise or walk more. At least do 30 minutes to 60 minutes of brisk walk. Try to do some resistance exercises as well as aerobic exercises. And beyond that, sleep on time, sleep adequately, sleep well. And then of course, de-stress and smile. So therefore, really the need of the hour is to prevent heart disease and diabetes. And therefore, if you really want to take care of this twin epidemic of heart disease and diabetes, we need a very aggressive lifestyle prevention approach. In 2017 end, we are releasing the 8th atlas of IDF, where it is predicted that India again will overtake China as the number one country in the world in diabetes. But we should not be the number one country in the world with diabetes. We should have aggressive lifestyle prevention so that we can prevent that diabetes. And secondly, what we need to do very aggressively is we should really aim to be the diabetes care capital of the world, the heart care capital of the world. And I think if diabetologists and diabetologists and uh, cardiologists come together, we can do a very good aggressive approach of a simple ABCD with lifestyle integration so that we can make the quality of lives of our heart patients and diabetic patients better.